Hi everyone, this is Troy with DigitalHill.com. Today we're going to take a look at installing an app onto an iPhone that's in development. So what we're going to be doing is installing a .ipa file. And so what we need in order to do that is to first plug in your phone to your computer, go to iTunes or launch iTunes, choose apps, and this will show all of your apps. From there, you want to drag the app over. I've already put the app on my desktop, the .ipa file. So you want to drag that over, put that into your app so you can see that show up right there. Now it's in your app so you want to go ahead and find your device. So right there's my iPhone. I'm going to click on that. I'm going to choose apps. I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to find this app in the list of all the apps that I have um, installed and not installed. Uh, this is Crossroads right here so I want to click install. So it says will install. I want to click apply. So that'll apply that. And then after that, I'm going to sync things up just to make sure everything's pushed over to the um, iPhone. Uh, also, just a note that you do need to incorporate a UDID for each device that you want to utilize this way. So, and that can be done within the uh, iOS Apple developer area. You can add that information in there. So once that's synced up, it'll the app will show up in our list here as installed, and then from there you can look at it on your phone and, and uh, play with that. So right here it shows the Crossroads app right there. Um, you should have that on your phone as well. You can log or look on your phone and, and play with that app. It's a great way to have your client um, pre-install information before submitting to the iTunes store and have them play with the app prior to uh, it going and being submitted to the iTunes store. All right, again, this is Troy with DigitalHill.com. Thank you.